I had bought two of these, but I left the other one. Uh, they don't sell this. Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm home. I've had such a long week actually even contemplating whether i should vlog or not it's my first week in my house it's my third week back in china um and all i can say is yo <laughs> literally yo guys i've just been so so busy with everything uh, I'm, I still haven't settled I still haven't unpacked my stuff in the kitchen I haven't been cooking since I've been here imagine three weeks without cooking um, so also I want to you know start eating healthier um, guys I watched one video of mine uh, I think I posted it about my moving out video from last year and I was like oh my gosh I was so much smaller my face looked so much not so much but my face looked smaller and I, I was like okay you know what it's 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 bound to happen because I'm running um, a food blog so I I eat guys I eat and I'm all I'm always eating the food that I cook right so I was bound to gain weight and when I was home I wasn't so active like I am in China um, so I gained a lot of weight I haven't weighed myself yet I think it's been months since I weighed myself but I feel heavy and I think my face is very much round now uh but I'll, I will try to work on that i will definitely try to work on that that's the perks of running a food blog you have to also like you know manage your weight while you are posting the delicious food um so i want to unpack the kitchen i want to unpack my stuff i'm not going to unpack everything but most of my things are literally kitchen um equipment um i want to unpack it because i want to start cooking again i miss cooking guys i think it's for the first time i feel like i need to cook i feel like i really do miss cooking i miss being in the kitchen i miss eating my own food um i've just been eating chinese food and i love chinese food but you need a break you know i, I need a break so um but my weekdays are quite busy i don't get the chance to cook but tomorrow is sunday i will have time today is saturday um saturday what time is it it's like 5 20 so i want to do that i just want to you know rest a little bit i just came from i was outside running some errands and i did go for lunch i ate at i'm gonna show you guys um you know where i ate i ate at a place called yummy box i think it's a it's, it's an american inspired restaurant um they sell american cuisine like your wings what else burgers what else do they have i don't know well yeah guys so i just went to eat and i grabbed a nice um drink i had juice from there yeah so then i came home after doing everything that i had to do outside today so this is a beginning of a new video i think i want my vlogs to be a little bit longer yeah i think my videos are short what do you guys think the thing is i feel like if i post long videos some of you guys won't really watch the whole video um i myself i don't watch long videos because i have a very short attention span so i feel like 20 minutes is enough for me but you guys can let me know if you want longer videos yeah so 
yeah guys um i've talked enough um and i will definitely be catching you later i don't know what we'll be having for dinner definitely not cooking today but i do need to get the kitchen ready because it's time it's about time it's about damn time you get me so yeah guys catch you guys later I'm about to unpack things some of the things that i brought with me from home i don't know why this mic keeps doing that <laughs> but yeah so i got myself these i usually use these when i am too lazy to cook and i use the this i bought like three of them when i'm making like my sausage if you go to my pulp to my my polka dots <laughs> if you go to my food blog you will find you'll see that on my sausage um video i did use this so yeah and i also brought um this spice i've never used it but i thought i should try it um it's the durian curry and then i bought these i was supposed to cook with these at home with this at home but i didn't so i thought i should bring it with me so that i can try it um i wanted to make um what is it i want to make tuscan chicken with it is it Tuscan or Tuscan or how do you say it guys? Yo, uh, hey, I Twitter, so I see me. But yeah, I also got this. Right. I didn't really buy a lot of spices because I think I have learned to live without using spices from home. So I usually use like the pure spices like i think i've mentioned mentioned this before and i use um chinese spices which are quite easy to find because i'm in china of course duh. <laughs> so um yeah i didn't buy a lot of spices at home you'd find that people buy like um robertson spices but you know if you want there are spices that you can find i think everywhere in the world if you want curry curry is curry you know but i think with chakalaka you do need raja <laughs> with when you're trying to make um chakalaka you do kind of need raja i think i don't know it just tastes different but when i am cooking i just use spices i find and i think if you're using pure spices like your garlic powder your onion powder your paprika you can find those anywhere i didn't have to buy it them buy them at home i also got um this gravy powder i want to try it out with the chicken i'm sure it will taste well i didn't buy this when i was home so yeah i'm still going to be i'm going to be trying it out i think there are people who can help me buy things from home if i desperately need them but i'm not sure if i'll ever be in a situation like that um i've just brought one bottle of this there's a chicken recipe that i posted and i used this as a marinade so these are like spices i use when i am being a lazy cook so yeah i also have aromat i don't use aromat guys like literally these things that i bought are things that i don't usually use i am not an aromat person but because i do sell food i think that it's only right for me to kind of use aromat in some of my ingredients because my customers are mostly south africans and they would want that aromat taste in their food so i only got this sachet <laughs> so that's because i don't use it much but yeah we'll see how it goes but i think i can also find it online it's not going to be hard for me to find aromat in case i want more but yeah other things did i get any other stuff yes i did let me go find them here we have more stuff i got this i had bought two of these but i left the other one because i was like 
Ah, uh, luggage, not knowing that I would actually have an extra two kgs. But anyway, stuff was way better than exceeding it. Um, I got this one, this Nando sauce. I think, I'm not sure if you can find this one online in China. Um, I think they do have, um, they have Nando's sauce online, but it's like those, your peri peri, very peri, or extra peri peri, I think, but they don't have these ones where you have the, um, braai, you know, the special, you know, flavors. So I decided to get that. I showed you guys this when I was at the airport. I want to try it out. I got built on. I had, I've already had a packet. Also got like chips. I have already had them. Because <laughs> one thing about me, I don't waste time. And then I got this mayo. Um, yes, there's mayo in China, but it doesn't taste as good as mayo from home. So I just bought this. The reason I didn't buy like bi a bigger one was be is because I don't use mayonnaise like that. I use it, but I can literally spend weeks without using mayo. So I don't need a big one. I have a sudden um, obsession with acha. <laughs> So I got some acha, but you guys know like the, the those achas from those red top um, packs, you know them, right? Those are the ones, those are, those, those, those slap. But um, I just, I was in a rush when I was buying my stuff. So I went for this one, you know, cause I didn't want to be shopping from different places, you know, just went to one shop, got everything. Yeah. Um, these, you can only find these in ShopRite or Checkers. Um, they taste really good. Unfortunately, I only have one packet, which is okay because this is part of the reason I have gained weight. Okay, these, one thing about me, oh, my nose is itchy. One thing about me, guys, I will eat these, okay? And once I open a packet, it's over. I cannot even, you know, say, oh, I'll have some and leave some for tomorrow. No, I eat them and I finished them once. <laughs> um, here's another flavor. I really like this Mozambican paprika flavor, um, peri peri um, Nando sauce. I think this too, you can only find in SA. I'm not sure if other countries sell it, but uh, they don't sell this in China. So I went for this as well. Trust me guys, all of these things are going to last me long. And I got myself some popcorn seasoning because why not? <laughs> so I think that's all I got, guys. That's literally it. I didn't buy too much food because I did not want to exceed my luggage limit or luggage allowance. So I tried not to buy too much and I did leave there are other things that I left. Um, I was like, Ugh, you know, I've lived without these things. Why would I want to um, now, you know, buy them like I can't live without them, you know? And also I have to explore more Chinese spices, right? So I think, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Anyways, now, I need to unpack, okay? I need to arrange this kitchen. I have four, I have three housemates, right? And they do not use this kitchen. Let me show you. These are my boxes, you can see. Um, they literally don't use the kitchen. Like, when I tell you that this is my kitchen, I am not joking. I don't know what this is. Okay, I think these are like detergents and whatever because we have a machine over here. Wait, I'm trying to spin this. Yes. We have a machine here. So I think that's for that. 
but otherwise you see that's mine that's like my laundry detergent and then from there you see that's my pot and those are not mine but I don't know which dishes they wash honestly because there's absolutely nothing in there look there is nothing like it's my kitchen it belongs to me these are mine these are my spices you see I don't know guys I don't want to throw them away I'm just gonna check the expiry date and see if I can still use them you know because I don't believe in throwing food away so yeah that's my stove and then in here it's empty so yeah it's my kitchen like it's my kitchen nobody can tell me nothing so in here I have my oven I have my it says glasses over there and my air fryer is in here so I want to unpack those because I feel like I do need my air fryer and I've also ordered some food from Walmart. Walmart will be delivering my food soon. I feel like this is the first time I've ever talked so much in a vlog. Hi, I don't talk like this but I just need to address a couple of things. I will. The mic is facing which way? Hey, I was saying this is the first time I have ever talked this much in a vlog. Me, hey. Well, that's because I need to address a couple of things, and I need to show you guys because we moved in last week, and yeah, I have a kitchen. That's the main reason I moved into this house. I live with three other people three but I'm grateful that they don't like cooking that's a win for me let me show you guys the fridge that's the fridge there's nothing in there do you see just juice and then there Wouldn't you move in if you were me? Wouldn't you? check if this air fryer still works or not kitchen cloth <laughs> so I need to buy a fatuku it's probably somewhere I, I, how can I not have fatukus I probably have somewhere I'm just not sure where because I remember I had some that I did not use new ones so i need a fatuku and some i used to use them for content so ish, i have like four boxes that are written kitchen so also i don't want to open all of them 
because I'm not going to live here for long. I'm going to live here for three months. Starting from today, it's exactly three months, I think. So, 100 days. Would you want to pack, unpack everything for 100 days? I don't think so. literally the food that I bought for myself um, because I am going to be um, I'm gonna try to cook tomorrow but tomorrow also I have to meet up with an ex colleague of mine my Chinese ex colleague she said she wants to meet up so yeah but at least I can still also cook on Monday and yeah so this food cost me a hundred and thirty kwai hundred and thirty kwai that is probably close to 400 rand for this food. I feel like that's actually not expensive. Considering that I have meat as well, I have shrimp, I have chicken breast, I have chicken wings, I have, what else did I get? Yeah, I showed you guys what I got. So I do not think it's expensive. I feel like it's extremely cheap. Um, I also have these fruits dragon fruits are not cheap so yeah i got my food from walmart quite reasonable quite cheap i think walmart is like probably the shop right of china i don't know i could be wrong but yeah these 14 kwai nine kwai no nine kwai so these were like 20 something rands and i think the the prices are quite similar but no 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 they're not this is broccoli broccoli at home is 30 something 35 a head of broccoli should be like 35 rands at checkers this my dear is close to 10 rands or 12 bucks so vegetables in china are quite cheap you go to pick and pay to buy this it's quite expensive but if you go to the chinese shop it's, it's cheaper but i got this for four kwai i think two kwai or four kwai i'm not sure very cheap guys 
but yeah that's one thing i love about china mushroom how much did mushroom cost me i think mushroom cost me around i'll check i'll put it somewhere here but it was also not pricey but yeah i'm gonna pack this up and wash up um the the cabinets and then and wash up everything and yeah then just eat a fruit you know because i had fries and i'm feeling guilty especially because i've been saying i'm trying to lose weight <laughs> so yeah i'm just gonna try to have a fruit for dinner like maybe i'll have the dragon fruit and the mandarins nasties guys i only found out that these are called like i think mandarins or tangerines but yeah when i first came to china i used to call them nachis to people like no they're nachis and they're like what what's that <laughs> not knowing that's 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 how we call them back home but people everybody else doesn't call these nachis it's just us it's just us but yeah anyway catch you guys later i think i've talked too much in this video um i'll show you guys the food everything once it's in the once i've packed up yeah i think i think maybe i'll show you guys when i'm washing them as well i don't know i'll see i'll see So I just thought to myself that I don't need I don't need all these things that I just washed. One fork, one knife, one spoon, one tablespoon are enough. I don't think I'll be hosting anybody. I'm just gonna take out one for each. You know? and the gold ones for my content because i literally only use them for polka dots because they look good they're photogenic <laughs> so i am literally not even trying to you know i can just put them in here why am i washing everything like i have a whole family when i'm just on my own so i'm gonna also pack like one plate and maybe probably two plates just for content sometimes i put like two plates and you hear people saying um are you is there somebody there with you and i'm like no it's just for content sometimes you can't you can't always be putting one plate you can't always be putting one plate even if you live alone like for content for content's sake i'll put two plates and then when i'm done shooting i pack the other one i'll eat it later <laughs> so um please don't mind my dry lips okay guys uh yeah it's after eight now and yeah just gonna pick one of each or maybe two forks just 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 to be safe right right guys yeah it works it works <laughs> my architecture um professor used to say that it works it works. Yeah. It's finished.
fresh in my water. Look, what am I gonna drink? <laughs> I'm actually tired now. Uh uh. I've been doing this since what time? It's nine. I think I've been doing this since five or four, five. Yes. No, guys. I'm gonna rest because I'll use this tomorrow, I think. Am I cooking tomorrow? I didn't buy onions. Like, that's so strange. How do I forget to buy onions and garlic? Of all things, it's fine. I'll buy them tomorrow. Um, yeah. I've packed everything I need. I think my chopping board is in this box that has the oven. I don't want to open this box. Also, I don't know if I'm going to use the oven because I'm going to use the air fryer. The air fryer saves time. So when I need the oven, I'll open it. This box that has glasses, I don't think I'll open it. I don't need those glasses. I don't need. I really don't need them. Um, well, we'll see later if I will need them. Um, yeah. Guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Can you see my lips? They are screaming hunger. So I need to eat and I need to have my dinner. Yeah. I'm about to have my dinner. Here it is. If I happen, I know guys, I bought groceries, but I'll, I'll, I'll cook tomorrow. <laughs> I'll cook tomorrow. Yeah, I think. But if uh if it's too long we'll have a part two of this vlog or maybe start a new one um yeah so i'm about to have chicken Hamenji. i think i've had this in one of my vlogs last year i'm actually really tired i'm just watching some vlogs on my iPad and then after that I'm going to sleep because ciao it's been a long 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 day so I just want to show you guys my dinner and close this vlog if it's too long I'll see when I'm editing but I have a feeling that it's quite a long one so long for me is like 20 to 30 minutes so if it's exceeding that then I'll definitely um, start a new one so let me show you guys my food and yeah okay so I'm trying not to get the shadow but that's how my food looks yummy right i'm gonna have it with this rice over here yeah so that's it Guessing I'm gonna catch you guys in my next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Love you loads. Goodbye. I'm sorry, I'm a bit tired now. <laughs> that kitchen, whew, extreme work. But, anyways, I'm gonna catch you guys in my next video. Toodles. Oh, yeah. <laughs>